show you guys what I get from BeautyCon and then do a little haul for you guys afterwards. So just enjoy this little clip of BeautyCon or whatever and then I'm gonna show you guys what I get at the end. Back or whatever.
so what? you're gonna be part of my vlog. Do what? You're gonna be part of my vlog. Oh yeah! was I think nine about nine years old she was in a group called girls time yeah and there was a girl there Ashley who was a year older than her she was much bigger much stronger had a strong voice and um, and so Beyonce was in the group and she brought this girl to the group because she used to compete and she met this girl and brought her there and so shortly after she would come home hoarse all the time and she'd say they aren't letting me sing lead. They're just making me give everybody their harmony and teach them the steps. And so she was like, you need to go up there and get them straight. And I remember saying, she said, because they're not letting me lead and I brought her there and they didn't tell me thank you. This is my little sister. I just came home from beauty con or oh, whatever. <laughs> and she just wanted to say hi for the outro. Of okay, so I am going to film this um, outro to this vlog plus haul type of video that I'm doing for you guys. Um, I just want to show you guys what I got um, for the general admission Saturday only ticket to beauty con. So I got this huge bag here to show you guys. Um, I got a bunch of bags for sure, um, not only samples and like beauty products and stuff like that, but I also got a bunch of bags. Sorry if my voice feel, sounds in, sounds terrible because I am super tired and it was like a two hour drive coming back home. 
but I also want to add and say that Candy Johnson commented how beautiful my makeup was and I didn't get it in the clip so I just want to say that in this outro part so I remember when I look back at this video that she said that and I will remember that she said that and that's all that matters if I remember what she said then that matters and I can let you guys know that she complimented my makeup after I ended the video so short when I was filming her but now that that's that sorry if you hear my dog in the background she's trying to get my attention Whoa, she wants to say hi she wants to say hi hi Mooch they get it Mooch you want attention just let me show them what I got okay okay <laughs> okay so now let's start off with a big old haul this is this huge bag that I got here and I'll just show you guys what it's got. So I'm gonna first start off um, with a bunch of samples that I actually got. So oh my god, it's already falling out of my hand. So I'll just throw that on the floor. So I first um, got this is probably gonna not be in order. Like I got I got a bunch of stuff from a bunch of different places, but I got a starter kit for a hair coloring kit to color my hair. Um, literally stand in this freaking line for Sally's Beauty Supply for over an hour. It was ridiculous, not even worth it. I just want to say that off the bat, like they overhyped it. Sally's Beauty Supply was probably the only um, vendors there that was giving like whole products instead of samples. So I just want to say that off the bat that I want to say this was overhyped, but I know for sure like the people in front of us probably got more products, but it was just overhyped because the more you waited in the line, the more like of the products were like being given out. So we would get like the leftovers pretty much. So I pretty much didn't even get what I wanted in the first place for even waiting in the hour. So off the bat, that was not worth it. But at the end of this video, I know this video is going to be all over the place, but I just want to mention if the general admission for day one is worth it at the end of just showing this haul i just want to get this over and done with and then talk about um if it's worth it at the end of the video because i know some people don't want to watch that and just see what i got so just look out for that so on to the next so i got this and then this as well you could choose any type of like hair coloring um, color that you wanted I originally wanted like blonde or brown but like I said the more um, you waited throughout the day the more less products that they had so that was that so I got this for my baby sister because she's like into coloring her hair right now and then I got this booklet this is a key thing key I cannot stress this enough I use this book throughout the whole entire day. It shows you what numbers and what vendors are going to be there. And on the last page, it shows you um, pretty much like an agenda of like where you can meet your influencers and what station they're going to be at and stuff like that. And then it shows you a big old map of how to get place to place. So this was most definitely really helpful throughout the whole trip so get you guys that because i originally got that when i went to will call i had to go to will call for my wristband but that's a whole other topic that i will talk about at the end so wait for that and then i also did get two of these and i want to say these are from like oh, they're from glossier is the brand i never really heard of them but I got two of these from them and this is one of the first places that we stopped at and the line wasn't that long I want to say it was like 10-15 minutes to like get the stuff and they were just like passing it out so I just asked for an extra one and they gave it to me so I what I received in the first bag I think they're the same thing but these are the play color slide eye pencils I think it's the blue and purple one it's not showing up purple but those are that or maybe it's brown no idea and then i also got a german engineered sharpener probably for those from them as well and then i also got a glossier cherry balm 
skin slate is what it's called and it looks like that so that's what came in the first bag and then it gives you like a little card of them and that comes like in this cute packaging so that is that and i just want to check the other box to see if it's like the same thing just double check them just to see through it yeah it's the same exact thing so i got two of these and then i also did like the spin a wheel type of thing and you could win like any products that um came up on the wheel when you spin it so i won like any of the free products that they had so i could choose whatever which one i had and this is from the vendor or company called the bomb and i got their face primer so that's gonna be dope to try out i also got two of these these are from Pu pori i hope i'm not mispronouncing that but it's called the Pu pori pink citron toilet spray interesting so it's just like a little sample of their spray that i guess you can use in the restroom i didn't even realize like that i also got a free one of these it's like a fan it's super freaking cute i love them it reminds me of like the brats dolls so this is from the company called sand onir and that's their instagram and website I'm watching you leave she just really quick fucking hit me this is what she does because she wants my attention she literally ate my beauty blender okay moving on with the video i also got this cute bag which i was like dying to have because all it's all a bunch of these girls that carry these around and it's such like a cute like summer beach bag it's called um the brand is called curls unleashed and it looks like this pink um see-through type of bag super freaking cute i wanted it so bad and then i also got a coconut oil deep conditioner soap type of thing for your hair so it looks like that it's gonna be dope to use and try out i also got a bunch of cards from like that company that i just showed previously for the fan i also got like they were handing out like a bunch of like different cards so that was that and then i also got a pop band hair ties and they say like the beauty con on it i don't know if you're able to see it but it says beauty con right here it's super cute it's like a champagne it actually matches my top that i wore and then i also got another bag from palmer's and it says choose what's real i actually didn't check what even came in here but it came with a coconut scrub for your face, a facial mo moisturizer, and then a coconut oil for your face. So like a sample of those. It also comes with conditioner and cleanser for your, your hair. It looks like that. Also came with a conditioning. It comes with the shampoo and then the conditioner. Looks like that. And then the last two are going to be a coconut oil body oil and the hair mask. So the hair mask and then this is the oil so a bunch of samples that just came in this bag here but that is pretty much what's in the pink bag and then what i didn't show you guys before but i wanted to wait till the last um this is actually the only purchase i actually made at the con oh i'm like dropping everything but i am gonna enter snapchats at the end of this video as well because i did see a bunch of influencers but i didn't meet them i only met bretman and then um candy johnson that you will see and I pretty much saw from a distance was Manny MUA, Daisy Marquez, and I think that was it. I tried to see Nazanin, but I had no idea where her booth was, so that sucked. But I picked up lashes from Hank and Henry's company, and I will insert videos of that. Um, that was pretty much like the highlight of the whole trip was 
I took my mom to BeautyCon originally for her birthday and all she talks about and is obsessed with is the only influencer which is Hank and Henry so I was so happy to like have her meet him one-on-one -on -one and like have a conversation with him and they were so cute Hank and Henry loved her I like gave him a whole entry or not an entry a whole intro about my mom how she always watches him on Facebook lives and then Instagram lives and like has always been a number one supporter and like he just fell in love with her off the bat so that was super cute and I will insert all of those videos and photos at the end of this video but pretty much I just picked up a thing of these lashes and I want to say every product throughout BeautyCon was 30 to 40 percent off all their products but um these were only 12 dollars and I want to say they normally are like 18 dollars so these are the false mink synthetic lashes it has five sets in it and I want to say these are in the lash f 820 is what it says but those are what they look like they're super cute and then again it comes with like a whole bunch of like cards and stuff like that but my mom has her bag signed from him so I was also happy about that as well but overall from this point on into the video I'm going to talk about my overall experience at BeautyCon and if you should go if I recommend it so off the bat um parking was not that crazy i want to say parking was like 20 dollars, so not too bad i mean i paid for the whole trip for the most part because it was for my mom's birthday again um i do want to say i wish i got the haulers pass and i will okay sorry about that guys oh my gosh it's just so loud in my house and i expect it to be loud because it's already like 10 o'clock at night I don't know what the heck is going on but i do want to say i recommend getting the haulers pass if you do end up going to beautycon because what i saw from my experience is that a whole bunch of people got to go in early so you get an earlier entry one two you get a whole bunch of more brand new products and probably whole products um like a whole i don't know how to explain it like a whole product not a sample from these companies and I kid you not, like, girls were, like, dragging their bags because how heavy the bags were, which I was so jealous of, and I tried to upgrade because it was my mom's birthday once again, and this whole trip was for her, but once again, it was sold out, and it was just too late, and I just recommend for future self and for anyone that is watching this to get the haulers pass because you do get a lot more products and a free, um, not a free, but an early entry to see all the products that are coming out and stuff like that also again i did not have a problem with waiting in line actually we did get super lucky um after will call we got our wristbands and i want to say that was like another 10 to 15 minutes to wait in the will call line after that we just walked straight in um we didn't have to wait in like this two hour long line like outside in like 80 degree weather was like ridiculous because that's what we drove by originally and we were scared at first that we were even gonna like have to like wait in that but thank god like they were already letting people in and we were already inside getting our tickets at will call so we just walked right in afterwards so i am super thankful of that because we were pretty much in ac throughout the whole day um i want to say overall the day went by pretty freaking fast honestly we thought we were gonna see a lot more influencers and get a lot more stuff in the amount of time that we had because beautycon is 11 30 or at least for the general admission it is 11 30 to 6 p.m and overall it was a fun exper experience i wanted to see more influencers um than i wanted to but a lot of stuff was just like going wrong like either there was too much people waiting in line and they would cut it off or um overall it was just like too much people like waiting for influencers pretty much but i got to see them close enough to like get all these videos that you guys are going to see at the end of this video but pretty much i do recommend beautycon i mean it is worth the experience it is worth trying out all these new products it is a, such a good time to like hang out with friends and family and like they have bomb food they have taco trucks they have a whole bunch of like just fun stuff going on like you were never bored at beautycon unless you're like waiting for like dumb shit like this. i'm just kidding i'm just kidding <laughs> i'm just salty because it wasn't my hair color so don't listen to me but overall i do recommend it for anyone that wants to try it out and 
yeah i mean if you guys have any other questions for me i have my instagram linked down below you guys can ask me any um questions in the comments um thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys soon and i hope you guys love this video and this vlog type of haul and i hope you guys experience this soon because i highly do recommend going to beauty con and it's just so much fun i mean i can't wait to try out all these products and yeah so i'm just gonna close out this video here and i hope you guys have a good night and a good day wherever you guys are watching this and i will see you guys in the next video bye